How you doing, Simba? Simba is Simbarific. Are you Simbarific? Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. 8.15 a.m. Good morning, Boo. I have the brush, and I want to brush him. Come on, Boo. Over here. Okay. I gotta switch hands. Boo loves being brushed, right, Boo? You love it? Hello, Boo. Hello, Boo. Good morning, Stella. Stella, Splash, and Simba were downstairs overnight. So here's Stella, and here's Boo, and here's Simba. I just gave the cats some oat grass to eat. So they're gonna munch on that while I make myself something to eat. And Boo's in his room. He already has his breakfast. And yeah, I need to get on with my morning. I'm definitely running a little bit late today. Simba has been jumping gates this morning and running around the house. And I have not seen him limping, which is good. Okay, the downstairs cats left some kind of a treat near their water bowls. Don't step in it, Simba. Man, it looks like duty. But it could be like a hairball thing. It's really gross. So Simba got brushed this morning. Stella got brushed this morning. And I brushed Splash for like two seconds. <laughs> and now Simba wants to eat the brush. <laughs> He's purring away. I already like filled that up and cleaned it off already. So this is like from the second round. Simba, do you want to eat breakfast? Simba, let's eat breakfast. Come on. Boom, boom. Simba loves the brush. Almost as much as Boo. Okay, time to eat. Time for breakfast. Hello, Stelly. Stella tolerates it. And then, and then she doesn't. And then she says, I've had enough. It's 10 a.m. right now and I just gave Boo the second half of his breakfast. This is the new thing he does. Instead of eating it on the plate, he like pulls it off the plate and eats it. And right now, there are no gates in his door. I just heard Simo jump off the cat tower in the other room. Hopefully he won't come in here and try to steal Boo's breakfast. Mm -hmm. 
still is hanging out with the shamrock. Maybe she was playing with it. Okay, so right now all the cats are like on free room together. Boo just came out of his room, but Stella's here and she's not looking too happy right now. I mean, look, look at her ears. And then she's like swishing that tail around. So, um, yeah, I am going to put Boo back in his room because I need to finish getting dressed and I can't sit here and watch the cats. And, um, I don't trust Stella. Actually, you know what? Maybe I could put Stella in Boo's room. Right now, Simba's in my room. I could probably put Stella in Boo's room. And let's see what happens with that. Let's see if I could pick Stella up and put her in, in Boo's room. She has to cooperate, though. She might run. Okay, so that was easy. I just picked her up and I put her in Boo's room. Like, she did meow at me a few times. And then when I put her down in Boo's room, she hissed at me. But right now, I think she's under the daybed. So, we'll see what happens. She'll hang out in Boo's room for a little while. Simba was on top of the cat tower in my room. And now he's here saying hello to Boo. Come on, Boo. Uh -oh. I don't know if Simba's leg is still completely healed. I don't know what Boo's gonna you know, do. Okay, Boo, come on. Okay, so Boo's been hanging out on the bed while I'm getting dressed. And the door to the room has been open and Simba was just lounging around in the hallway kind of in front of Boo's room, which Stella is in. And then all of a sudden Boo got off the bed and he like ran into the hallway and he spooked Simba. And Simba just like took off down the hall and like around the corner. And because Simba's still healing a limping leg, I don't want that happening. So um, yeah, so right now Boo's back in my room and uh, I'm just gonna keep him in here a little while. I just want to keep him and Simba separate for a short while longer until I feel like Simba's leg is healing more. Now I have not seen Simba limping in days now. That does not mean he's not limping at all. I have not had a chance to check all of the security camera footage because it takes a really long time to check all of it because it's motion activated. Anytime there's motion, it records video. So, um, yeah, I don't know if he's 100% back, if he's 100% not limping. He could still be limping sometimes. It's just that I have not seen him limping. I, I feel like he's doing better, um, but I don't want him to, uh, you know, make anything worse by, you know, freaking out because, you know, Boo jumps or anything. Okay, right now we have musical cats going on. We have Stella in Boo's room. We have Simba in my room. We have Boo on free room and Splash is on free room. The two of them are both in the living room together and I am going to sit here and edit today's video and they are both going to behave. It's about 1.30 p.m. Boo's been relaxing on his bed. Hello, Boo. Let's say hello to Simba. Hello, Simba. How are you? Simba's been sleeping on the cat tower. I've been in here a few times and he's been zonked out. But I wanted to bring the camera in this time. I hope he doesn't fall off the top of that. See how he's like hanging? He's like all hanging off. Hello Simba, go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. How you doing, Simba? Simba is Simbarific. Are you Simbarific? This is his limping leg. I'm such a fluffy boy, Simba. 
He's so soft and fluffy. Okay, I'll see you later, Simba. Oh my god, you guys just missed it. So I go to walk out of the room and then I hear like this big whoosh and like a squish. And uh, Simba jumped from the top of the cat tower across the room onto the bed. Simba's turning into a flying feral. A flying former feral. The flying former feral. Simba could be in the circus. He could be like a circus cat, right? You should have been wearing your cape, Simba. It would have been perfect for your cape. It is 10.50 p.m. And I'm here in the living room with Stella. And I'm just about to play with her for a little while before I go to bed because it has been a very long day. And I'm really tired. I'm also listening to a lot of wind outside. Oh my gosh. I can't believe how much wind I'm hearing. You see Stella? This is one of her favorite games. It's called Put Something Under the Scratch and All. Splash and Simba are downstairs eating crunchies. Maybe Stella wants a feather. Stella, you want a feather? I got Stella's pink feather. Let's put it back. Simba just came upstairs to see what's going on. Stella wanted some girl time. I have Boo's black feather here. The reason why Boo is in his room is because I'm just about to go to bed. Because I'm exhausted, I've had a really long day. And I don't need to be chasing cats all night. And I do need to be getting a good night's sleep. Splash is watching from a few feet away. I think he wants to play. Come on, Splash, you gonna play?
Thank you for watching this Lucky Earl's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.